Hi, I wanted to do a video on autopilot and how uh, quickly or often it asks you to grab the wheel uh, to acknowledge that you're alive. So this video, I'm on a highway, but there are some decent turns in the highway and we'll see uh, how it does. Okay, I'm going to do a video to uh, see how often the uh, warning to grab the steering wheel comes on. I believe it's every three minutes, or at least the first three minutes and then the second three minutes that it occurs. So we're going to start right now putting on autopilot <clears throat> and uh, we're going to see how this works so we'll be able to time it on the YouTube video. And uh, I'm pretty sure the pattern that I've seen is after the first three minutes it um, asks to it asks for you to grab the wheel and then after another three minutes it should do it. So uh, we started at 58 I believe. So we'll see on the clock in the car there. So people have been saying I might not be, I'm, this might be faking, so I just wanted to show you I do not have my hands on the wheel or my feet on the pedals. Autopilot is driving the car and I'm on a nice, uh, nicely lined highway here. It's a little sunny out, so. Uh, a little hard to see this video and I think when we get to maybe 6.02 on the clock or right before 6.02 it might uh, ask us to grab the wheel lost the left line there because there's like a uh, exit here uh, for a second but it's uh, got it back Again, the two blue lines on the dash let you know that the car uh, sees the lines in the road and it's going to keep the car in the center of the road. Uh, keeps it dead center usually, a lot better than most drivers do. And uh, it's uh, taking this turn, which was a mild turn, we have a, a sharper turn coming up here. You'll see it uh, be able to take this turn pretty well. And a lot of times I do keep my hand close to the wheel like this, but I don't, uh, and I maybe sometimes just touch it, but I don't steer at any time. Okay, there's the first wobble. That might have been because of the sharpness in that turn. Uh, I think that was a little before three minutes, but uh, on the video when I play back, we'll be able to tell. But it was around three minutes, I believe. Okay, so now we'll see if the next one comes at six minutes. Or if it comes uh, upon some incident. We were in the middle of uh, finishing a pretty large turn there. So that might have um, accelerated when the warning came. I believe this next one will come around the six minute mark, if I'm not mistaken. That's sort of the pattern I've seen. You can see the ultrasound sensors going off uh, whenever we pass a car or there's a, uh, um, like here coming up, we might get the left sensors picking up this wall. ultrasound sensors. There's ultrasound sensors all the way around the car and uh, there comes one. So I picked up that van uh, coming up from behind us. So we're at the four and a half, about four and a half mark. So we took that turn without a problem. Now we have another turn very similar to the last one coming up. Let's see if uh, asks us to grab the wheel uh, on this turn. Yep, it did. See that? Uh, so, 
could just be on uh, certain conditions. Uh, it wants to see if you're there just to make sure you get through this turn. So we've got a pretty big, steep turn. And again, all I had to do was grab the wheel a little bit and wiggle it to relieve the message. Uh, if you don't relieve that message, uh, it will start blinking uh, a white light and then start beeping. Uh, maybe I'll let it do that on the next one. I won't acknowledge it right away. And uh, you'll see that it goes from just a little indicator on the bottom of the dashboard to there, there it goes. Now it's white blinking and eventually it's going to start beeping. I'll acknowledge it after the beep. It's blinking faster. There we go. Now if you get three of those, you uh, it autopilot disengages and you can't re-engage it without stopping, putting the car in park, and starting up again. So it's like three strikes and you're out. Okay, well, uh, that test uh, said that it comes uh, quicker than three minutes. Um, I'll try another video uh, when we're on more of a straight road and see uh, if it's uh, different. Take care.